सारा देखी प्रेसिंग अधिकार पर भी जोर उपस्थित संपूर्ण तारा की मित्रा रू पत्रकार मित्रा रू यहाँ उस सभी लाई हम लोग छोटो सूचना प्राप्त होना साथ समय दे रहे विशेष महत्व के साथ पाती हुई है कुमार वहाँ विशेष धन्यवाद देना चाहते हैं समय विशेष शिक्षा को संदर्भ में भी सुबह भी बनी अमिले ओपन सोसाइटी फाउंडेशन को सारे सपोर्ट में नेपाल में तांडो ताकुन लोग के दिल बाजा समय विशेष शिक्षा संबंधी अंतर्राष्ट्रीय सम्मेलन करने वाले जब जनकारी को पुताल जनकारी करते हैं कि वो कोविड के कारण ले संपन्न होने न सही के न सही कुछ संदर्भ में किसलाय अमिले समय विशेष शिक्षा प्रबंधन को लागी तीनी वाला सस्ता प्रैक्टिकल तो ये फर्स्ट बड़े एक्सपीरियंस पर भी काम करोगे क्या कि हमने तीस बड़ा प्राप्त हो सही कि सुझाव दो कि सुझाव आ रहा हूँ लाइफ में हमने एक एक लगा सभी तरह से पपड़ी काम करोगे क्या कि तो तेरी पूरा लाइफ सपोर्ट करने को लगी ओपन सोसाइटी फाउंडेशन में जो डायना जो यो इंडस्ट्रियल इंटरनेशनल को पहला प प्रवासन है अमिले दिन अंदर सफल कर दिया जाता है तो अमिले सवाल की बनन अब इस पर जब डॉक्टर सांग आप उनका निश्चित बार बार वाले नेपाल में जाने तो स्वामी इस शिक्षा को मात्रा ही होगी ना और अकांग्रेस तो भाई जब बिल्कुल तो आज का प्रोग्राम को लाइक नेपाल में तीन पश्चिमी काम और बैठे हुए हैं तो काम और लाइ र हमीले जी थप अधिकार प्रोग्राम को लाइक किस तो करने पड़ सकता है यूएन सीआरपी के सामने मेरी जोड़े लाइक जाना तो लाइक इसे सरीर में उनसे बंदे इशारे जो ना हमले से जा प्राप्त हो राहमले दिन अंदर प्रेस करी पर नवंबर में हमले वाले के दौड़ी � सीआरपी और जो हमरो नेपाल में दिन सम जो ना हमरो सेंट्रल लेवल में अगर इसलिए कमिटी बनी कुछ है इसलिए कमिटी बनी नेपाल में दिन सम जैसे करी अस्सी बाद में नासम नेपाल राव पिछा साल तक तब पर निकल गयी ना हमरो राय को दिया इसलिए कमिटी अभी सेंट्रल लेवल का फर्न्स दे रही है तो इसमें ज्यादातर � युक्ताय कुछ साल तक रहेगा तो ना इसमें वहाँ से बहुत अपनों सभी अभी पाइंट रहा है अभी अपार मतलब दिव्य पच्चे वाली की जो आज बोली भी नहीं अभी कई सभी लाये कुछ हैं विजय अभी सब लोगों का पाइंट का मूवमेंट कैसे चल रही है या चल रही कुछ है अन्य रिप्रेजेंटेटिव ग्रुप वालों को जो आवश्यकता है तो � तीन छापलों आ रहे थे पर तीन बार आ रहे थे एक बार भी कार्यक्रम रहा कुछ है तो सारा कुछ इस चारों संदर्भ में यहाँ आ रहे थे पूरे आ रहे थे उधर शहर में आ रहे थे इसमें देरी कर जोड़ना चाहिए ना और पहले पूरा चाहिए आ घर परिवार समुदाय और विद्यालय और पकाने से भाई के बाल वाली के आदमी पति बाप बाप वाले घर विद्यालय भाई लोग होंगे जब अन्य सदर में विद्यालय में आज भी डेट आ रहा है मेरे पांच सौ दिन में उन तो दिन बाद सदर में घर दर विद्यालय भरना अभियान को संदर्भ में घर दर अभियान संतानों का भी बचता है घर दर अभियान को करना इस आपात का भाग बिल्कुल उठ ले पश्चिम विद्यालय
यो अर्जुन किया सोसाइटी सामान स्वयं कार्य करेगा स्वयं कर्म को उसे किसी जो एन नेपाल ने दिन सामने सफर कर रहा होगा उसका एन बिजली जो भी स्वयं कर रहा होगा उसका इसके अंदर नेपाल ने इतने दूसरे भी वास्तव में बनी वो यहाँ करो ट्रांसलेटर जो है वही पूरा तो ग्राहक स्वयं कर रहा होगा उसका फोन पर जो भी बोली सपोर्ट वगैरह हम संस्था में होते हैं सब इसका ना हमी राष्ट्रीय बैंक में आज से नेपाल समस्त लोग ना हो जाते हैं बनी हमें विभिन्न संस्थाओं से बोले को और लोग लाइक स्वीकार कर रहे हैं तुम्हें पारी को संस्था में विभिन्न लोग संस्था में बोले को लाइक सारे को लोग से इसके लिए धन्यवाद देने चाहिए आपको � यहाँ आप बोलिए आपको पढ़ने में सुविधा आपको सिर्फ तो यहाँ पढ़ने में यहाँ आपको बहुत कुछ है इसको लाइक मत करना दे दी अब यहाँ ऊपर से सभी साथी हो रहे हैं अंतिम चुनाव पास में बहुत कुछ लाइक मौन रखो तो शाम तक भी आपके यहाँ सुविधा में बहुत कार्य करने को चाहिए तो हमें आदत है आईटी on our request, uh, the government officer from the Department of Education, he has consented uh, to stay in this workshop. So I'd like to request Narod Damala to take a seat of the special guest in this session. And uh, we have a very collaborative effort with the Alliance for Social Dialogues. And I'd like to request Mr. Swam Nidola to take a seat at the case in this also. We are here, the representatives of uh, the CRPD and STC committee, and this committee is uh, functional since last two years, and uh, this is being facilitated by Nepal Association of the Blind in support of NAPP. So representing NAPP, uh, I would like to request the chairperson of Nepal Association of the Blind to take a seat. Yes. And uh, of course, uh, uh, we all are here. Uh, I would like to request all our colleagues and friends to take a seat. Uh, here in this session, uh, I would like to start with uh, uh, the situation of people with disability uh, from the perspectives of the development cooperation and particularly would like to focus on how disability has been taken care of by the government as well as by the development cooperation and it is the perspectives of the organizations of people with disability as Nepal Association of the Blind has uh, uh, closely observed the the policy framework, the framework of the development cooperation, and also in uh, so some of the agenda in the United Nations for, um, the framework for uh, development cooperation. And, uh, uh, over in, in overall, we see that uh, there are something prominent gap in the development cooperation. So reviewing the sustainable development goals and the disability targets, I would like to request Mr. Narvatur Limbu to give a presentation on behalf of the consortium. So you can give either in English or in Nepali, no matter. Let's see um, something heavy in your body. <laughs> anyway, I would like to try. Um, try to, I would like to try making you laugh. You see. Yeah, thank you very much, Dr. Vinendra, for giving opportunity to Nepal Association of the Blind to sharing um, various activities which is organized by NAB as well as other organizations and what is in STG implementation. And also, I would like, I would like to, um, it is a great opportunity on behalf of, uh, on, on, in representation of Mr. Dr. Z uh, Dr. Gerald, special reporter, he is also with us. It's our very um, important function for us. So, and development partners that we are working for disability 
they are also present with us. It's also very a good opportunity to share with you. Yeah, as Mr. Dharam told, <coughs> Nepal Association of the Blind has formed a five years uh, tenor committee to monitor the STC and CRPD implementation uh, from civil societies as well as government side. So every three years, every three months, we have a meeting and uh, it will be continue up to 2024. Some disability sectors are still left. In future, we are trying to uh, conclude them. We are thinking about this um, issue also. And, uh, the CRPD and STG monitoring committee we have, there are many, uh, uh, all national organizations are uh, included, except some, uh, including National Federation of the Disabled Nepal. Um, we are working together. So, um, every year, uh, we discuss every, in every meeting, what kind of activities has done by the civil societies means uh, OPTs. We can we use OPTs, organization persons with disability, what they have done. And that reflect we made reflect every meeting. And in end of the year we make uh, one report. Then the, the report we will submit to the uh, concern ministries and other um, agencies. Um, and we have another one very um, small group regarding STG monitor, Inclusive Education Monitoring Committee, which is, uh, uh, which is formed to monitor the, especially Article 4, no one left behind in STG. So uh, we visited uh, schools. We uh, then we made a report, and we whatever labs are there, we will uh, uh, communicate to the uh, province government, local government, as well as uh, federal government. This is the our process. So uh, the the main objectives of this committee's report uh, is um, preliminary preparation for the shadow report uh, um, the, to submit from our OPTs group in 2024. So we are uh, making preliminary report, collecting these informations and uh, whatever, uh, whatever new issues and whatever what uh, uh, issues has been addressed by the government and which has not been addressed by the government yet. These things we will evaluate and make the uh, report. This is the ones. Then, uh, as I told you before, uh, in past session, NABP, Norway Association of the Blind and Parcel Circuit, is our main partner of um, the main partner in Nepal. We have been working from 1998 until then. Um, maybe it will remain up other more, more years. Then we, right now, we are, we are, we are, we are, we have started to work with Danish uh, Association of the Blind uh, from 2021. So in this in by these partners, uh, we are getting support to implement the uh, different activities, especially inclusive education, empowerment of the blind and partial sighted people, and then the, 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 the project indicators are um, focused on that. And the Nepal Association of the Blind has uh, also mobilizing another resource 
that is from 2022, uh, which is DRF fund. That is a small fund, but uh, in policy change, it is, it is helping uh, in very important in the important way. So, um, the, the, by mobilizing this DRF fund, we have changed some uh, inclusive, uh, educational policies reviewed and implementation plan of government we reviewed with the government, sitting with the government together, the Ministry of Education and uh, Center of Education, Human Resource Development Center uh, and Curriculum Development Center. And these are also with us to review the policies and to change the, some indicators. We reviewed um, a few months before we conducted one seminar to review the education indicators which are made by government based on uh, Article 4.5 uh, 4 and 8. That is the, the that is, uh, no one left behind is there. To, uh, to address this uh, um, issue, the government has made, made indicators, many indicators are there. So which were the, we reviewed it and some lapses we found. The lapses thinks the government uh, had um, made a commitment to review it um, very soon. The another thing, the, especially is in the CTBT, which is called CTBT, it called government TBT, Technical Vocational Education Training, whatever, like that. Uh, but in this issue, the disability component has not been included very clearly yet. That's why we intervene on that um, uh, policy also. Government is preparing right now 10 years plan to implement TBD. On that uh, uh, issue also, uh, government has agreed to make uh, special section for the persons with disability in TEBT program. These are the some uh, things. The other NGOs, other DB, uh, OPDs are also doing many things uh, which are not uh, kept, uh, captured in my mind. Maybe, maybe they will say in the letter um, themselves. But um, OPDs has done um, there are many activities in inclusive education part, uh, especially here at uh, SIE and uh, CBM, as uh, we, we found in last session, they have also done the tremendous job. But we don't know how many um, the disability sectors are uh, actively participated or not. I don't know. That, is, uh, that comes later. But uh, here I would like to mention one thing. Uh, um, in regards of implement implementation of SDG, we are, uh, we, OPDs and other INGOs, they are uh, then focusing mainly, no one left behind. But other issues are very important for uh, persons with disabilities. The hunger, hunger is not um, implementing, uh, touching, in my opinion, no, no INGOs, no OPDs has touched the hunger. Hunger is very important and um, uh, um, very inevitable um, sex of the article because disability and poverty are working together in Nepal. Um, Nepal is, a, see, as I told you before, 83% geography is in hilly and mountainous area. Urban areas are very um, the low number, low percent. Only 70% are in plain and valley area. So more poor people are living in far from of the country. They are facing a lot of things. They are. Uh, uh, confining in the four walls. That's why sorrow and uh, some 
and anxieties are there. Many difficulties are there. So to focus then, we have to work on uh, hunger part also. We have to co cover the hunger part also. And we are not talking about very much uh, CRPD Article 28, which is uh, adequate life. We are not talking about nutrition for the persons with disabilities. These are also very important. So what I would like to request you, uh, partners, those who are working for persons with disabilities, these are very important. Slightly, the um, emergency preparedness uh, and other law injustice, these are um, slightly uh, covering by the, especially of um, OPDs, but uh, these important things are, many important things are there, and the employment issue is also there, livelihood is uh, also there, these are also need to be addressed. Maybe some KLM is uh, focusing on livelihood as, as I yeah, um, as, uh, as I know. And, but uh, these are the coming issues to cover the, uh, to cover the issues and uh, to provide well service to the persons with disability and other advocacy are going on with the government. Actually, advocacy part is quite strong in Nepal because we are working together here. Many organizations we are here. You can uh, observe all we are here. So they are together. They are they have a harmony. You you can understand. And these things and I, I as Maracas Treaty regarding uh, education. Uh, reading and education rights, Miracle Street is very important. We have tried, we have, we have been trying for many years to ratify from the Nepal parliament, but due to political instability and um, the parliament, dissolveness of parliament, we could not ratify it yet. So hopefully, now just a few months before, the new parliament has come. So within five years, we will able to ratify the Menakas Treaty. Uh, we are working on that um, very seriously. Mr. Birendra, me, and in the in, in previous time, Social Ba is also there. And um, about, about our effort is going on, but the result has not been come in hand. Thank you very much for giving opportunity for us.